Harrison Barnes. You're listening to Three Point Conversion. Um, JB, it, it, um, it looked like you made a concerted effort tonight to try to get Malik involved as best you can. Um, where would you, after tonight, how would you put that situation? It's just day by day. I mean, I'm trying to get him back in shape, trying to find some rhythm. Um, you know, we'll see where he's at, you know, moving forward from here. But I, I believe in Malik. Um, we, you know, I need to get him in better shape, but I think he's moving in the right direction. And I saw some bright signs tonight. I saw some bright signs uh, tonight where he's getting more comfortable out there. Uh, tomorrow will be another day. And as much time as you has put put into the small ball lineup, how do you think it looks? I'll have to evaluate. I'll have to watch the film. Um, you know, I'm not sure exactly right now, Rick. I, it hasn't been great overall, but uh, a big part of this, Rick, is going to be with Gordon Hayward in, with the small lineup. I have yet to have Gordon out there. So Gordon's going to be a big part of our small lineup. I'm not going to sit here and judge the, the small lineup without him in, in, the, in, in the mix. So um, we're going to play small. Um, I like the versatility it gives us. Once we add Gordon to the mix, I think uh, it's going to be, be a very productive lineup for us. Thank you. Sam Perley. Hey, JB. No, it wasn't kind of a slower start than the other three preseason games you had, but you guys really battled back with the 30-2 the to two run. What would you, how would you kind of contrast the two halves? What changed between the first and the second half for you guys? Yeah, it looked like we were ready to get to the regular season in the first half. You know, um, thought we played a, a good, you know, third game. We came out, we weren't as aggressive. And, um, you know, it looked like we were ready to get to the regular season. And second half, I thought we, I thought we settled in in the second quarter. I thought we found our footing there in the second quarter. Um, we didn't score it as well as I liked to in the second quarter, but, you know, held them to 25 points. Um, and then we found some urgency there in the third quarter. That group was, was great, you know, mid, mid third, end of the third, end of the fourth, 26 0 run. That's the type of group we have here. It's a feisty competitive group. Uh, we found some rhythm, rhythm there in the second, uh, second half. Richard. Yeah, just kind of your uh, Richard Walker from CarolinaSportsHub.com. Just kind of your now after four games, obviously I haven't seen a tape of this game, but your feelings moving forward, and obviously the the real bullets start flying next week. We're excited to play a regular season game. I think everyone's you know ready to move forward. Um, you know, we played four preseason games. We've learned a lot, and we're going to learn a lot on Wednesday night about our team. So um, we're excited. Uh, I like what we have. Uh, brewing here and we're ready to play. You know, I think our group is excited. Um, looking forward, hopefully we can get some good news on Gordon and be ready to go on Wednesday night. Jason Brown. Thanks Maggie. Hey JB. Um, I know you still have to look at the, at the video of this, but did you learn something new about your team tonight that maybe you didn't know? I mean, uh, you touched on the effort, but I'm just curious if you learned something new that maybe you didn't know coming into well, there's a resilient group. I think that's probably, you know, you're going to need resiliency in this league. You're going to be down at times. This, this is a tough league. So there's highs, there's lows. Obviously, we had a low there, you know, getting down, I think, is as much as 20, 23. But we never die. You know, this is a resilient group. We've had that sort of mentality last year. We're, we're, uh, we're never going to drop the sword here. And I think we did that tonight. We erased their lead, 26-0 run, built up a lead. Uh, you know, when I took out our, our main group, we had a, a nice lead there and it was their, to their credit, you know, they played hard, got us back in the game and, uh, we move forward. All right, guys, we only have time for one more question. So Rod Boone. Hey JB, what are you seeing so far from PJ Washington out there? It seems like he hasn't gotten to a rhythm just so far this preseason. What are you seeing from him overall and what do you expect from him this second year? Yeah, I expect a big year from him. You know, I expect more of him and he's going to deliver for us. I believe that, um, you know, he's, he's struggled at times in the preseason. But look, I believe in him. We need him to be special and he can be. He has that ability to be great. And um, I saw that fire there in the second half. He ignited a lot of that that run there. And that's the urgency. That's the fire I need. And that's the fire we need to be a great team. 
Thank you.